Hi folks, just popped on to say hello. Here's Mr. Jack in my favourite sleeper that all my boys have ever worn. All my actual babies and all my reborn babies. So this week, poor Alita hasn't been dressed at all. I don't like leaving her pyjamas or cosies because, well this is cosy. But I want her to be looking like she's on her way out for a wee walk. So, anyway, I was just, I'm feeling really sorry for myself. We've all been a bit down this week under the weather in this house. We've had, it looks very much like, um, certainly I have long COVID. And um, Albert hasn't been great. He was ill first and then Damien got sick. So... Here's the little bottle. My favourite thing ever. Anyway, so I was just feeling sorry for myself. This is my new bear. I got this new bear now. It's the one thing that cheered me up this week. He's called Lennon. He's a Charlie bear. He's hard to find. He's sort of limited edition. The thing I love about these Charlie bears is they're such great value and that is a lovely quality bear and really for what I paid for him he has this key around his neck but you just feel the quality so Charlie bears are the way forward so he's watching Jack as he sleeps with his little uh, jelly cats bunny and the postman shouted in the door at me and left me a box. So here's the box. Now this box, I was sort of alerted to its coming. I took the wrapping off the outside. It was much like this. Only my name was on it. But as you can see, I haven't gone any further. And, oh flip, look what we're looking at. Oh flip, what the way to cheer up a Friday afternoon. Tanya, this is a card. Now this box is from our Auntie Cam. Um, I don't even know if I can open this card on here. I don't even know if I can write it out so whether I should or not. Um, That's what it's been like this week, midwinter. So I'll just, just let you see a later. Darling Tanya, enjoy this little box of bits. More to follow when I get more sorting done. Love you, sis, always. Okay. And I quite often talk about Auntie Karen, but probably a lot of you don't know her because she's not massively into her videoing anymore. And our Auntie Karen's had a dreadful wee while recently. Now, I am lifting out of this box, look at it. All of these things are mine and I'm going to stash them all for me. This is for a lady, oh my flipping favourite colour and it suits her so well. It's like a long sleeved vest, onesie. This is for a lady. Another long sleeve vest or onesie. Now these will be invaluable because they'll go, I love pinafores and or dungarees. Let me see what size they are. Sorry for my glittering. My hands are not good. As I say, I'm very um, mid or rheumatoid glare up as well at the moment. So, right, okay, well that made much sense. No glasses on. Oh, and there we are. I think these are next. Not the three months anyway, they'll be perfect. So I'm going to hide all the munchies down the side. This is a beautiful coral coloured um, cardigan. Now, this will be going on to Alita very quickly lovely knitted. I love knitted stuff and 
all of my knitted stuff and in fact anything that I have nice in the house comes from Auntie Karen. These are the socks to go with that. Beautiful. Oh, this is just precious. A long, or sorry, a no sleeve, a sleeve less pink onesie. Absolutely priceless that you can't get from anywhere for love nor money. My very favourite. Oh, flip. I've just noticed. A little bear. Oh, he is gorgeous. Um, I have... I had always trouble sleeping and, oh flip, look, this is project. I just couldn't not mention it. Oh, I can't wait to get that on him. That's beautiful, Karen. Oh, thank you. I had no, I had problems sleeping and I always had uh, an animal that I would have taken to bed. It was a frog actually. And his name was Brian after my rock star god, which was B.A. Robertson. And I was having trouble sleeping. I was going through a very difficult time. Um, eight, nine, ten years ago, at least. And Auntie Karen sent me one time in a box. Ted. And Ted's been with me ever since. Now you've seen Ted on some of my other videos. So everything that Auntie Karen said is treasured. And uh, here's another pink long sleeve onesie. But now we've got another Auntie Karen Ted. Do you want that, Jack? Or a lady, do you want that? Lovely. Oh, here's two headbands. For class, because I have got very few of those, fellas. I'm not a girl baby, or I'm not a baby girl um, mummy, generally. Oh, this is beautiful, oh, for goodness sake. This is the nicest sleeper I have ever seen for a baby girl. Oh, flip. Of course the light's coming at the wrong time. I was just about to make this video when Damien came down and started messing about in amongst it. But he's away for the weekend now, so... As I say, he hasn't been well, so I can't really begrudge. But there's a beautiful coloured button. Uh, the Mini Club do covered buttons. And, uh, you know, of like a contrast in colour. But these little elephants are beautiful. That's gorgeous. Can't wait to see that on. i flipping another Ted. You can have one Ted each, babies. Now, this is something I haven't had for a long time. Wouldn't have thought to get, but a little needed. You have that down there, baby girl, with you. The light is just playing silly tricks. Oh, look. This will do the tiny baby. Holly. A pink penguin. Oh, look. Oh, do you know, Auntie Karen, this is my Damien had the nose when he was little and I spent most of my time turning it up and down. That's fabulous. I like the kind of that. Two. Oh, look. Oh, for goodness sake. This will be going on at first before I This is a knitted one piece. Uh, like cozy winter snow suit because this is the sort of thing when, it, when my children were little, my older boys certainly were little, they wore pram suits. And the pram suits were worn over the top of baby grows because most babies wore baby grows back in the day. And this is perfect. This is absolutely a pram suit to wear over a baby grow. And this is how they went out in the pram. Until they were a good age. And here we've got lots of uh, nappies. Eco natty. Now I've seen these in other people's Healthy Baby, Healthy Planet. Quite a few of those. Those can go into my lovely nappy bag. I must show you all my lovely nappy bag. Here's um, some, I think these are Pampers pull-ups. Yes, Pampers pull-ups, size three. 
Perfect. Lovely. And we've got one, two, three, four, five of those, and I think four of the other ones. Good grief, what a haul. And there's them. Look how beautifully lined this box was. Now, I am absolutely the worst friend in the world because I am always grabbing things and meaning to send them out and not. But I must, really, really, really must do it. Oh, sorry, lady. Lost your cup. I must get something into that. Put some milk in that cup. It's so hard to do stuff with one hand. Anyway, that is just the very tonic I've needed. Jack's under the, the nappy pile. The sweets are hidden behind me and the cord. And there's my linen Charlie Bear hiding in the background. So thank you, Auntie Karen. You're an absolute darling and I love you to bits and I hope the rest of you are feeling better. I hope any of you that have had COVID aren't still this, feeling this fatigue. I've been having rashes, I've been oh, barely able to move. So lucky I got through the week in work. But I have and now that's just made my week. Thanks so much again. I love you. Speak to you all soon. Bye.